All right, it's time to go inside TMZ now for all the latest from Hollywood. And joining us, as always, is Dax Holt with all the headlines. All right, so let's start with Justin Bieber. Okay, he just got his license like a day ago. So now he gets into a car accident with his Ferrari. What happened? Uh, that That is true. He was out here in L.A. driving around his uh, super expensive Ferrari. Well, it's not even his. I, I think it's a rented Ferrari. Uh -huh. uh, but the thing is, he was driving around, and apparently a Honda uh, kind of like swiped him. It wasn't a major accident by any means. It was more of a fender bender. Mm -hmm. uh, they obviously stopped, got out, was going to exchange information, and uh, there really wasn't much damage done to either car, so they figured, uh... Well, we should probably just go. No need to exchange information. While well, Bieber's people stepped in and said, "Let's do the right thing. Let's call the cops. Let's make them come out here yeah. because obviously Bieber's a big star. And so if he was to leave and then the other person goes, no, it was a hit and run. You know, it, it could be bad. So the cops came out and they said, you know, there's just no damage. I'm gonna, I'm not even gonna write a report. So you guys just yeah. go on along with your your day. All right. Well, uh, now you have some big news regarding Dancing with the Stars. So the cast has been announced, and we now know Nancy Grace joining the lineup there. So you guys caught up with her after the announcement, and uh, she always has a lot to say. So what did she have to say now? Yeah, she, she's not one to keep quiet, I'll tell you that much. But she <laughs> yeah. came out of uh, one of the Dancing with the Stars parties, and uh, the first question is, so do you think Casey Anthony will be voting for you this season on Dancing with the Stars? And she said, uh, no, I'm not going to count on her vote, nor the votes from her defense team. I just don't <laughs> plan on them uh, ha supporting me on this. But, uh, you know, she went on and said uh, that her advice for Casey Anthony is to confess and go to jail, uh -huh. which uh, I'm not sure that's going to be happening anytime soon either. But, uh, you know, I think that it was a smart move on the dancing's part to cast her. Yeah. She's one of those people that people either love her or hate her, mm -hmm. and uh, so that you'll have the haters tuning in and you'll have the supporters tuning in as well. And finally, another dancing with the star related note. So Chaz Bono was also going to be competing, but somebody else thinks that that hurt their chances of being on the show. Who's that? Yeah. Do you remember the pregnant man uh, uh, yes. who had a couple children, and it was a big news story, Thomas Beatty, uh, he is coming forward saying that, look, Chaz Bono ruined my chances of being dan on Dancing with the Stars uh, because the transgender uh, quota was already filled. He says that he reached out to Dancing with the Stars producers a while back, never heard anything back, but then once he heard that Chaz Bono was on the show, he said, that is why I wasn't able to be on it. I mean, uh -huh. I, I'm going to say that I think probably Chaz Bono was a bigger draw than the pregnant man, but nevertheless, <laughs> whatever he wants to think. Oh, okay. Thanks, Dax. And you can catch TMZ <laughs> right here. Sometimes the headlines are just so bizarre. Anyway, for more information on those stories, you can head to our website, foxprovenance.com.